Hello friends, this is Samuel once again from Sony Tech. Okay, so in this one, I'll be teaching you how to use the latest version of Font Awesome, which is version 6, for free offline. Okay, so before we do so, if you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe, please like this video, please comment so I know your thoughts so that I can improve upon my new videos. Please share this video as well. Okay, but before we proceed, once again, but also is an icon library just as you have iron icons, bootstrap icons, and flash icons, and amongst others. Okay, so first of all, head over to your browser and search for Fonts Awesome. So you click on the first search result to see which is from the fontawesome.com website. Okay, so you then be linked to their home page, which is this one. So you click on start for free. Okay, so you click on download. We're going to download Font Awesome free for the web. So when you download it, it's going to appear as a zip file. But in my case, I already have it downloaded and installed. So do so and continue with me. Okay, so once you are done with that, this is the zip file you see. Right click on the zip file and choose extract all. When you extract, you see this folder, open the folder or double click. And when you open this folder, you see this folder inside with other subfolders and files. Okay, so what, what else can we do? And first of all, let's create an empty folder. And let's name this font. Yeah, font. So let's make a font hyphen 6. So let's open our original folder once again. And we're going to select everything here with the exception of CSS and web font. Click on and you delete. This should delete. Okay. okay, so I think you're done with that. So now, next, open the CSS folder. And select everything with the exception of the all.css and click on hit delete once again. So, next, grab these two folders. So, I'm going to copy them and paste it into our new folder, which is this one. Okay, so I think you are good to go. So, what else do you have to do? So, right now, I'm going to include our font into our project. So I think I should open another explorer window side by side. Okay, so side by side. And uh, I'll look at my template. Should be here. Where is my template? Oh. Okay, so my template. And I'll have to drag this and put it inside of my template folder. Okay, so nice. Okay, so now I can open this in Visual Studio Code and see if I have it here. Yeah, okay, so it shows here. Okay, so now let's link our our font. Also, I'm going to do link. I'm going to do font six slash CSS and all dot CSS. Okay, so next, what do you have to do? You have to visit the Font Awesome website and get some icons. So you click on icons and search for any icons of your choice. So let's search for, let's see, Facebook. I'm going to choose this one. Okay. Now let's include this in our project. Okay, so let me put the P tag and see. Hello, hello world. And uh, I think I'll add an icon here. Okay, so now let's open this with live server. I've already opened it with live server. Okay, so wait. Shows hello world. I can disconnect my internet and show you, but before I do so, let me copy another icon. So let me choose laptop. 
Let's do let's try this one more time. Let's do this once again. So laptop shoes. Let me disconnect my internet and see. This will disconnect my internet from here. Okay, let's see if it still works. Okay, so it still works. Okay, so guys, thanks so much for watching this video. This is basically how to use for awesome six offline. Okay, so please once again, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe, like this video, comment and share. See you in the rest of the video. Bye.